take two. Hey guys. Okay, uh, got an update. I have to get it out before I forget. <laughs> a lot's happened, man. You know, I don't even know if I'll get it all out. But, here's what happened. Loogie Man goes to zero. I don't know what that is, but he's there. Immediately, they move me down to the lower astral, right here on Earth, like where you see the ghosts. So I'm down here now with another Christ, a new Christ, and his family. And uh, he's taking care of me. So we go through all the introductions and what, and who knows what, and who knows, he knows what to do, and I'm telling him, my family's up above yelling down at me, telling him, telling him, helping out, explaining things about me and shit. Um, I want to know why I'm down here, and I asked, how long do I got to stay down here? And they said, four weeks. I had to stay down in the lower astral for four weeks. I couldn't go back to St. Lucian, which is on tier three. So I'm down here on the earth. Tier 3 is up here. My family is not yelling down at me. And so, I want to know why. They said they're a cleaning, the cleaning St. Lucian. Or the illusion of St. Lucian. Two things there. There's the illusion of St. Lucian. Then, and I'm, the way go, what do you mean you're cleaning? You can't come up here because it'll affect you, they said the cleaning process. Getting rid of all uh, what it is is anything that's not supposed to be living in the illusion of St. Illusion gets radiated. <laughs> I don't know what the word for I don't know if it's radiation or not, but it makes it I don't I don't know what it does. But they're doing something to clean the illusion of St. Illusion land. So anyway, I'm like whatever. So I'm down there two days. I'm down here two days. And I've been down here a week and a half, I think, already so far. And this all happened in a week and a half. You won't even believe it. You won't even believe it. It's, I was never going to make a video about it because it was so far-fetched, but it's real. Loogie Man can't find me. That was... So... I don't know if they're cleaning it on my behalf, cleaning out all the Loogie Man shit on my behalf or whatever. I don't, I don't understand what they're doing in the same illusion. I just took their word for it. And um, so I'm down here in the illusion. Loogie Man is up in zero. He's yelling. He's, he disappears. I don't know. I don't hear him and I don't see him. And I don't, I got no Loogies coming in my throat, up my butt. I'm fucking solid, right? I'm feeling good. Actually, it got boring. I was bored. Like, uh, I, was, I started getting bored. I'm like, what the hell am I going to do down here? Except sit in JC's house, you know. So he started giving me lesson dreams. And that was what he was going to do. And uh, they weren't... Yeah, they were lesson dreams. And uh, so he gave me a two, day, two or three days worth. And that was it. So, I did two or three days of lesson dreams, and they were extreme lesson dreams. What you do in extreme situations, okay? And I passed them all, hands down. I didn't even think they were extreme. I'm going, these are extreme? Come on, give me some, right? You know, car accidents and shit like that. Extreme situations, gunfights, all that. I'm like, come on, give me something, man. I go, I, I, I have nightmares that are ten times worse than this. <laughs> and I win. <laughs> anyway. I passed them all. Passed it all with flying colors. So much so. And then he tested my skills for one day. And uh, or at the same time. And he goes, he's like, hands down, this guy's the shit. And I'm like, yeah, can I go back to St. Lucian? He goes, no, you can't go for another three weeks. And I'm like, come on, man, really? 
then I'm like, screw this. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going for myself. So I will we'll take a look, see what they're talking about. So I went up to St. Lucian, and I was with my girlfriend, my new one, my new girlfriend, and we went to a bass, a music store to buy a bass guitar. I don't know if it was for me or for her or whatever. We were in there, and I was dreaming it. I was dreaming. I was in St. Lucian. We were going to a store buying a bass guitar because she knew I played bass guitar, and I guess she wanted one. I don't know. But... I'm in it and I started waking up. As soon as I started waking up, my head went, started ringing like crazy, like white noise. And my whole body started going like white noise. And I freaked out. I grabbed my head and I didn't know what to do. I was running around. And then Jesus goes, I'll learn you, won't it? <laughs> I'll learn you. He goes, I told you not to come up here because uh, you're going to get that we let you go we let you go so you, you got to learn the hard way and I'm like fuck so I, I busted my ass I dropped phew, straight back down and the noise went away and I'm like what the hell was that and he goes we're cleaning he goes anything that's not supposed to be anything that's not supposed to be we're cleaning the illusion of St. Illusion he goes you don't go he goes, anything that's not supposed to be in the same illusion, illusion, gets zapped like that and gets forced out. And there's so much going on in the illusion of same illusion, they forced out all the things. And if you live in same illusion, it won't affect you. But I'm always, usually, in the illusion of same illusion. So, I had to go down. They sent me down. And I'm like, holy shit. I haven't felt nothing for a week of Loogie Man, nothing. Then, after all that happened for a week, I started feeling Loogie Man during a hockey game. I was watching a hockey game and uh, pre-game. Then I started feeling burning on my face coming up. And I'm like, Jesus! So, they Loogie Man burned my face for around three days in a row. I never felt no, no loogies. No loogies were hitting my throat and other places. But I felt my burning really bad, like fire. This Christ can see almost everything. He's a really good seer, and he can see the level, and he can see where it was disrupting my skin and all that. And you can see the energy hitting my face. And he reported it, all of it, everything. Then, after that, he, he kept on doing it. Loogie Man kept on doing it. And I could start to hear him. I could start to hear Loogie Man yelling at me, way far away, way far away. And, uh, then, I woke up one after sleeping, I woke up one time, a couple days ago, and a loogie man was burning my face here, my face, and I fell asleep. Christ got rid of him. I fell asleep. I wake up, and a loogie man is yelling at me, right? And he's like, Hey, I bet you I do stuff. I bet you I know where you are now. Blah, blah, blah. And he's just yelling, screaming, angry, like fucking angry. And I didn't know what to do, so I grabbed a hockey stick and a puck because I was watching hockey. The last thing I was doing was watching hockey when I went to bed. And I'm, I got my, I started taking shots at his face. <laughs> and, it, and he looked at me. <laughs> Three out of five, I got him right in the face. <laughs> Slap shots. <laughs> that really pissed him off, too. You know, I, what else can you do? Yell back at him. I don't want to yell back at him, so I took shots at his face. With a, I hit him in the face with a hockey puck. <laughs> anyway. Um, and that, Christ documented all this stuff. He's documented all this stuff. That goes on. The next time I wake up, 
I wake up and the Sasquatch is back. Tia, whose name's Tia. The Sasquatch. This is all in the spirit world, lower illusion. I wake up and Tia's there and I'm talking, he's talking to me about stuff. He wants to know what an illusion room is. And I'm like, oh shit. And I don't know if he wants one for himself or whatever. But we're talking, he's talking. Jesus down here ain't never encountered him. He freaks out. He's a 10 foot squatch, Sasquatch, talking to me. I'm talking to him. So I leave him some apples, right? And he's like, apples, fruit, eat. <laughs> I'm like, get right on, brother, eat. You know, have a good time. And uh, whatever. So we're good. Like me and the Sasquatch, we're like, for some reason, he just loves me, man. Not like uh, relationship shit, just, you know, brothers sort of thing. A lot ticked off Christ. Christ told Christ, and all the Christ knows. All the Christ knows. And this is a situation that we don't need from Richard. So, Christ comes and talks to Sasquatch. The, the other Christ. Now, the Christ that went into his realm to talk to all the other Sasquatch realm to talk to all the people in that realm he came and told him was talking to him and said uh, it's not good that you're here keep a low profile sort of thing <laughs> um, that happened and it was all good I left I made him out like a teepee I made, he goes I want a room I want a room what's a room what's a room so I made him a teepee great big teepee and I put the uh, uh, pelts around it, like the uh, leather and put more sticks on it and I just made it and put a basket of apples in there for him I said room this is for you you and he goes sleep I'm like sleep you live in there yeah so anyway he's happy he got a place to sleep in the illusion right but I'm in I'm in some town Christian town in the lower illusion so when I'm there he can't come in there he knows that he can't come into these towns he likes it off in the woods in the illusion so Tia does anyway then <sighs> Tia sleeping in the tent I'm back over here not the tent the teepee way off far away yeah, I totally forgot about him. I don't even think he's real. But who am I to judge? I don't know. I'm like, Sasquatch, really? Come on. Hey, why not? Fuck. It's the illusion, right? So anyway, I'm sleeping. I wake up. And Loogie Man's yelling. Yelling at me. He's coming out of the blackness. Coming out of the blackness of the illusion. I wake up. I'm in the illusion. But I'm in, in this... Christian town, but I'm in the illusion, so you know, just like St. Lucian illusion, but well, this town has an illusion, is an illusion. Every town has an illusion, and you're not supposed to go in there within a perimeter of that. He's yelling at me. Look at me, he's yelling at me. He's like huge, and he's going, Richard, I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm fucking kill you. I'm gonna rah, rah, rah. And he's yelling at me like this, right? And I'm like, oh, shut the fuck up. Would you shut up? And he's all smoking mirrors. He's making him look like a demon. He's looking like a demon and everything. Yeah, I'm going, put the smoking mirrors away and shut up, you asshole. Why don't you get a life, you know? Go do something. Fucking do something with your life. Fucking leave me alone. And he's yelling, I'm going to fucking kill you. I'll never forget. And I go, what's it like to live in zero, asshole? Right? Shit like that, and I go, you want me to get my, he goes, you think you're some fucking hockey player, you think you're some fucking hockey player, I'll fucking show you fucking hockey, and he's yelling at me, all of a sudden, Tia comes fucking flying up, comes flying up, <laughs> and I see this, I see this, and my kids are watching, and Tina's watching, and Jesus is watching, and Tia comes up, like that, comes up at an angle like that, he's yelling at me, looking down, Tia comes running up, grabs the fucker, clubs him, I think he clubbed him on the back, 
Then it grabbed him and by his torso and flipped him and all. <laughs> Fucking loogie man goes, oh, fuck. <laughs> he clubbed him and threw him and all you see his legs and arms spinning around like that. <laughs> Then I started freaking out, like, holy shit, Gee, all the Jesuses that I know of that deal with fucking Tia come flying down. This craze is going nuts, my kids are going nuts, and I'm like, my face is burning, my face is burning. I realized my face is burning. Tia's beating this shit. <laughs> Loogie man. <laughs> I can hear the Loogie man. I go, oh, I'm a Christian, I'm a Christian. Holy fuck. He's crazy. I'm laughing my ass off because it was right out of the blue. I wasn't expecting it that Tia would defend me because he never did before, ever. But he is now. And I'm like, holy fuck. And uh, I don't know how much he beat him up. So after all that was done, Chris freaked out. He didn't know what to do. He went and talked to um, Tia, Sasquatch, and he went and talked and said, you can't, you can't do that. That's abuse, so you can't do that and all this shit, and I'm like, oh, that sucks, and then he said that you can't see Richard anymore, you have to go home, you should go home, it's your best thing to do, because your people and my people, we're not, we don't understand each other too good, and you can't come here, because you can't do that, so T got all upset, he didn't get mad or anything, he was very good, and uh, I, I barely heard any of it. But then I went back to sleep, and they were telling me about, I can't see Satya. Then, the priestess, I hear the priestess soon, yelling at Jesus. When Jesus goes back to St. Lucian, she's yelling. I can hear her yelling. And it was about, and I'm watching another hockey game. This happened yesterday. I'm watching another hockey game, and I can hear her in my fucking head. The priest is yelling at Jesus that he had no right to fucking dictate what the hell's going on with Richard and the illusion. And he got up, and there was a big fight. They were both yelling, like, mad at each other. No, the priestess is the equivalent of a Christ, right? And the priestess has been saving my ass my whole life. In, in, the, in the spirit. Because I saved her. I saved her life. And the Daniel Boone past life. So, she's... We, we got each other's backs from now on, right? I got her back, she got my back. She even saved my ass a lot in this life that I know of, that I remember. Thought I remembered, I remember. Anyway, so they send, T goes away, I say my goodbyes, he says goodbye, and he says he's going back to his own world. Then, I just, I just uh, woke up today, I went to sleep last night, and he was gone for a day, Christ sent him back. So Christ came back to Tia and said, you, you can see Richard once a week, because the priest has bitched at him, and he had no right to do that. But I get, he goes, Christ has to take care of Richard, but you can only help Richard, or you can only see Richard once. Once a week, and it'll be supervised with me. And you can see, but I gotta be there. That's what Christ said to Tia. That I'm allowed, he's allowed to see me. And he said, okay. I got no fucking say whatsoever in anything. I don't even get my own thoughts. All I do is get a loogie up the ass. And this fucking asshole. So, after that, it's done. I go to bed last night. My skin's just burning a little bit. Tia's gone. I don't know when I'm going to see him next week, I guess. I go to sleep. I forgot the dream I had. I wake up at 3. Nothing's going on. Like, I have a cigarette. Go to the bathroom. Go back to sleep. I wake up in the morning. I wake up in the morning. And there's a vortex. A fire hot vortex. Right here. Right in my fucking jaw. <coughs> right in my jaw. I'm fucking flipping. I'm going crazy. I need help. Crazy doesn't know what to do. 
he comes into me and he's trying to push it away, but it don't help. And he goes, here, maybe this will help. And he gives me like tin foil. He goes, put wrap this around the jaw. Like, like you got a toothache. Wrap it around. And I did. I just wrapped this tin foil fabric or whatever it was around my head. <laughs> My whole fucking head, my throat. I go, make me some underwear, right? <laughs> and it started to diffuse. It diffused, but the heat was still there. So I had this thing on my head. Then, the tinfoil shit, not in reality, in the spirit world. I put it on in the illusion. And so, Grace is heating me up, heating me up, purging all the poison out of me. But, I'm freaking, and he... And I, and I hear Tina, she's yelling at me, and I go, what do I do, what do I do, where do I go, I don't, I don't know this place down here, I don't know this town, I don't know Christ, he goes, I go, I go, he's fucking getting me, man, he's getting me, big time, and uh, Tina goes, run, just fucking run and hide somewhere, and so I do, I just fucking run, and I don't know where to go, because I can't fucking see nothing, and my heart only knows certain places far away that I've been to down here, one one is Bollywood, <laughs> the junkyard <laughs> with my buddies. The other, the other is a uh, the Dearborn distribution center. I remember that, and that's where I was gonna go, but that's far, far away. And uh, I gotta relax and shine my inner light to get there because he's the only one who knows how to get there. I don't know how to get there. So fuck, you know where I ran? Right to Tia's teepee. Zoom. I'm in this fucking teepee and I'm sitting there and I got tinfoil wrapped around my head. All of a sudden, I can hear Tia going, Tia's. Tia is like farther away than anything, but I can hear him going, Rubber, 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 Picture, what are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, something like that, right? And I'm like, oh fuck. <laughs> I'm like, what do I do? What do I do? And I'm thinking of places to go. And then I went down into the into the lair. I went down the lair and I dressed in black, camouflage. And I was laying there. I got my shotgun. I'm laying there and just waiting for Luke Man. He's yelling. And Tina's yelling at me. She's going, just don't fucking move. Don't say nothing. She goes, Luke Man, they're hunting. Christ is looking for Loogie Man right now. They don't know where he is. And they go, do you see Loogie Man? Not in the illusion. He's sleeping. So he's in the illusion yelling at you. That's the illusion. He's yelling at you. That's his illusion soul. Where's his real soul? Where's his skins? Where's his body? And I go, I don't know. She goes, well, look. So I looked around. And all of a sudden, boom. I, he was laying there sleeping. Wherever that was. Up, up higher than me. And I go, there, I see him. And Christ is in me. Christ comes and he goes, yeah, I see him. Because Christ can see. Christ can see me looking at him. Christ is in me. So he looks where I'm looking and sees him. So Christ goes, I see him. Then all the other Christ surround, make a bubble around him, like personnel around him. And I guess, I guess he came into St. Lucia and was looking for me. That's why there was APB out on his ass. All the crates surrounded him. And now, they got all that stuff that he was abusing me when I was down here. Plus stuff in, in St. Lucia. So, they grabbed him. They came down on him. Bam! They grabbed him. Took him away. He came out of the illusion back into his body. His soul body. Came out of the illusion, back into his soul body. They grabbed him and they took him away. I don't know where they took him. He was yelling and screaming. He was so pissed off. Then I I fly back to Christ's house where I was staying, where I was supposed to be protected, but I wasn't. As soon as I go wherever I am, wherever I go, wherever my soul is sleeping or is at, as soon as I go into the illusion, the fucker attacks me, man. So. Christ don't know where I am because I've gone. I've gone in the illusion. So they have ways of keeping me down, but I don't want it. I just want to be free in the illusion and fucking do. As soon as I come back to the illusion, that's when all the shit starts. When I'm in the illusion, no one can find me. I'm just doing what I want, wherever I go, whatever I'm doing. 
information, but they have ways to find them even I don't want it, so they don't do it. Now, this is hard to get your head around, but this is the way it is, so be used to it, guys, because it's coming. Um, Tina, Tia runs back to the teepee where I built him the teepee. He's there, and Tina goes running over at my kids, and they got the camera, and they're filming all this. And Tia, she's explaining, she goes, look. Whenever Rich is in trouble, you help him. I don't give a fuck. He goes, but Jesus Christ told me not to help. Like that. <laughs> I'm like, holy fuck. And she goes, he's wrong. He's sorry. You see Rich in delusion and he needs help. You fight. You fight the bad guy. You fight the bad man. And Tina takes my fucking wife is saying this. Tina, she's overriding Christ's orders for Tia. Tia's all fucking confused. She's saying, you fucking help Rich. I don't give a fuck. And uh, so Tia's, Tia's like, okay, <laughs> I'll help Rich. And she asked some other questions, like, how long have you been watching? So what that, because they always thought that Sasquatch, Tia, was an entity from the Loogie Man playing me. They didn't know. They didn't know if I created Tia or if Loogie Man created Tia as a distraction. They didn't know, but now they know. Because Loogie Man was yelling at me, and Tia kicked the shit out of Loogie Man. Then this happened, and Tia didn't do shit. And this was the worst one, the, the vortex right here, the fire vortex in my fucking jaw right here. And uh, he didn't do nothing. He listened to what Craig said. Then Tina came back and said, fuck whatever Craig said. You see Rich in the illusion and he needs your help, you help him if you want to. It's not, it's, it's, you don't have to, but do it if you want to. And so, that's that. Um, turns out, I guess T is actually real. He's a real Sasquatch. And he's got his, he goes, he goes to his porthole and goes back into his realm. And he's not gay, he, he, he just, I'm his buddy. We're buddies. That's the way he sees it. And I'm like, right on. I always needed a big brother to hammer some shit for me. Fucking never had that experience. Christ don't do it. Tia, it's a whole new ball game, man. So, I'm like, fucking A, man. Fucking A. I need that. Never had a big brother to kick some ass. I, I'm not asking Tia to do it. I ain't doing it. But damn, it feels good when he does it. It's like, I got a shotgun, I can take care of that fucker by myself. Loogie man. But anyway, this is the drama that's been going on. I gotta upload this to YouTube and uh, the other one. Whatever it's called. We got 40 seconds left. Bit shoot. Yeah. Gotta load up the bit shoot. This is my uh, reality. So I'm down here for another, down in the illusion for another two weeks at least. Well, they radiate the illusion in the same illusion. I don't even know what that's about yet. I'm going to get more information and I'll tell you. But that's been going on for about two weeks. Talk to you later, guys.